guys! So a while ago I posted on my Instagram about my new safety razor and I got so many messages from girls saying that they've been kind of, you know, curious about them for a while but scared to try them and asking me to do reviews and stuff. So here I am today. I'm gonna share my experience with a safety razor with you today and kind of what I think, how it works, what it is, in case you don't know. I guess let me start by showing you my safety razor. This is it. Essentially a safety razor is what was used before our kind of modern day razor blades were designed. So the ones with like multiple blades and everything. It's a holder for disposable blades. So it can be made of, you know, various materials. Most of them are stainless steel. Mine is, and they are pretty heavy. You'd be surprised by how heavy this is. That weight actually has a purpose I will get to that later but here on the top you can see this is where you put the razor blade in so the blades that go in there are um, these ones the classic razor blades and I have to admit that one of the reasons I was hesitant to try this at first is I have <laughs> such negative associations with razor blades like these. I was really scared to buy these at first, but actually they're not that intimidating at all. So you can see mine here comes in a little box and you kind of just slide one out. They come wrapped in a little paper like that, so they're nice and safe. And you just take one out and use one at a time. So I guess let me just demonstrate how you put one in. I have one in right now, so that's why I'm holding it by the side because the sharp edges are on those sides and both sides are sharp actually that's why it's called a double-edged razor so for mine uh, my particular one the bottom screws off and then you can kind of take it apart like that so this is the bottom part then you have your blade i'm always really careful with these because they are razor sharp huh so yes this is the blade and then this is the top side so you just pop it on like that as long as you only touch the sides, you're all good to go. Then you pop this part on, you screw it back on, and by screwing, oh, the wrong side. By screwing it on, you kind of push the blade into that rounded part on the top, and that bends the blade into the right angle to use for shaving. So that's how it works. It's super simple. The primary reason for me for buying one of these was that I was tired of buying disposable razor blades or just things that I needed to throw away that were wrapped in plastic and then made of plastic and I just had to keep buying them all the time. So my number one reason was waste reduction but now that I've been using it for a while there have been so many more kind of good sides to this. So first of all it saves money because I won't have to buy like infinite razor blades. This should last me a lifetime and I, I should only have to replace the actual razor blades which are very cheap. They actually last pretty long as well. I've heard you can use one of these for a few months before you have to replace them so that is really good. So the actual razor itself is a little bit of an investment in the beginning. I believe I paid 25 euros for this one. I ordered it online but it should last me forever and these little blades I believe I paid two, two euros for 10 of them in this pack. Maybe it was 250, but yeah, that's about the prices we're talking about. So this is what I will have to keep buying. This I should have for the rest of my life now. So another great thing about this is I have noticed it actually gives me such a good shave. Oh my gosh, guys! My skin has never been this smooth as when I use this. It is ridiculous. It does a much better job than my disposable razors did and I am very very pleased with the results I get from this. It is a lot easier to use than I thought. I was afraid I was gonna have to be really careful with them and everything but I feel like that's just a case of getting used to it. I was really scared and nervous to use my first kind of normal regular razor blade as well. So I'm actually really positively surprised and very happy with this. Oh, another thing I wanted to say, it's really easy to clean. With my old razor blades, the one with the multiple blades, they were so hard to clean and kind of like hair would get stuck in between them and it would be hard to get out and then they would get rusty quicker and it was just really difficult. But with this, you should definitely clean it after each use. So what I personally do is I just kind of unscrew this thing a little bit so that it opens up a bit 
and then I just run water kind of through it and then I will kind of unscrew it, take the top off and dry the actual blade itself. I will dry it with a towel and then kind of put it back together and that way when you clean and dry it after each use you can use these blades for a really long time. All right so on to how you actually use this and that is kind of the only downside so far for me is that it does take a little bit more time but then on the other hand I have actually found this to be a really nice kind of relaxing ritual so what I do is I will usually put a face mask on just because this is a perfect time for that and then just take a little bit of time to do this and enjoy it as a little bit of me time. So the process that I like to go through um, when shaving with my safety razor is I start by taking a shower so that my skin is nice and soft and the hairs go soft and everything and the pores open up and then I will go over with a scrubbing mitt and I will just exfoliate my skin everywhere we want to shave but this is especially important on legs so I will just pop this on and then kind of you know just go over my skin like that exfoliate and then you definitely want to use something with a safety razor those kind of razors that have five blades they are designed to even out the pressure that is put on your skin so that skin doesn't doesn't get irritated as much safety razor doesn't have that so you do need some type of kind of lubricant i guess to shave with i like to use these shower mousses <laughs> they are kind of like a shower gel that foams up into a really kind of thick almost creamy mousse type thing so it's almost like a shaving cream or a shaving gel but it's a shower gel at the same time and this particular brand rituals they smell amazing so yes i like to shave with this so i will just kind of work that into a lather and then use my safety razor so what you want to keep in mind when using this is of course all the rules that apply with a normal razor so never go like that obviously kind of particulars for this one is you preferably want to go in short strokes you know what let me take out this blade so that i can demonstrate all right so i was saying you you want to go in short strokes like that and especially when you're doing this the first time go slow i cut myself once just a tiny little cut and it was right on my knee and I'm pretty sure I had a little bump of like an ingrown hair or something there and that's why I cut myself but it was the moment that I actually thought wow this is so much easier than I thought and I became reckless and I just you know just went at it and I ended up cutting myself so you do want to you know go carefully and slowly especially in the beginning when you're just trying to kind of figure out how it works and everything and use shorter strokes um what i personally like to do is every few strokes i just go back like that to kind of get the hair out but that's something i did with my old razors as well something you do definitely want to keep in mind when using a safety razor is to not apply pressure but let the actual weight of the razor do the job that is all the pressure you need to apply so you, all you do is just kind of lightly go over your skin and don't push down that's enough that's all you have to do so that is what the actual weight is for in the razor now like I said, I was surprised by how easy it was to position this properly. I was scared that I was going to have to, you know, figure out an angle or something. But honestly, it kind of, it is shaped in a way that it automatically gets the right angle. You can't really go wrong with it because of its shape. So when you just place it on your skin kind of intuitively it should be the right angle already so that is super easy to use so after i shaved i um, like to pat my skin dry on all the areas that i have shaved so no rubbing because of course the skin has been exfoliated and shaved which is like an extra exfoliator and of course shaving is a process that irritates the skin so preferably pat the skin dry and then apply a moisturizer some people i know like to use witch hazel or something natural like that or some type of oil coconut or olive oil i just use a kind of body lotion that's fit for sensitive skin as well so moisturize afterwards and then you are all done another thing i was wondering about is can you use this everywhere and the answer is definitely yes just like you would a kind of regular razor you can use this everywhere i have used it on my legs armpits and bikini area yeah it was just fine only thing you do want to keep in mind especially when you're doing you know down there is that this has two edges that are sharp you know that is something to keep in mind you don't want to cut the other side while you're shaving you know <laughs> I'm sure you can imagine what could go wrong there. So just be mindful of that. And also when you are shaving sensitive areas like down there, try to shave with the direction of growth and then kind of sideways and only then go up. That really helps to kind of keep the irritation down. Yeah, just a few little tips, but you can absolutely use this everywhere. As soon as you kind of get the hang of it, I would suggest starting with legs because it's the easiest place to shave and it's also 
the easiest to reach and kind of see what you're doing but all the other areas you, you can shave everywhere with this so yes in conclusion i am very happy with my safety razor much more so than i thought i would be it's not that hard to use at all it is convenient, it is nice and cheap, it is better for the environment than using disposable plastic razors. You get a much better shave out of it. Plus, you have a perfect excuse to pamper yourself just a little bit extra. <laughs> if you have any questions regarding safety razor use for ladies, then please feel free to leave them down in the comments below. I am kind of new to this. I have been using the, this one for a few weeks, I think now, but I will try to do my best to answer you, you know, as best as I can. So I really hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, guys. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for loads more beauty and lifestyle content. If you'd like to support me on Patreon, there's a link in the description box below. Thank you so much for your support guys there is a, another video here that you may also enjoy you can go watch next thank you for watching and i will see you very soon in my next video bye